I am presently at the Rodney Bay Medical Facility um, on a second review. Actually, um, based on what has been, what I have seen today, it appears that things are looking better. Persons are in their, in their rooms. Um, actually, there's no one on the outside. Persons understand now what it is to be to be in quarantine. I think it had been explained and the medical team is doing um, its utmost to explain to persons what, what um, quarantine is about. Um, I think they are receiving it better and then persons are there. I must report that based on the information received from the medical team, all persons are accounted for now. Um, that is the persons who run away, they have returned, and that is after they heard the message from myself. I would like to thank members of the public who assisted us in bringing these persons back. Um, one individual, I must say, um, I must commend the fire service who assisted us in retrieving that individual and taking them back to the to the center. I must also thank the police officers who are working very hard out there, um, especially with um, this COVID-19 and um, leaving their families and then to be there assisting. That is what um, we are there for and then we will continue to do it. I must say that it is a challenge now, um, especially with resources since we have the COVID-19, we have um, that two man, we also have um, other incidents happening and then we have to cover the entire country. I must indicate at this point that um, I am pleased that uh, the Prime Minister has indicated that he is in support and would be giving all the necessary resources that is needed to um, overcome all these challenges. I can inform you that at this point I have called in all um, the members of the police band, they are full full um, grown police officers. They have sworn as police officers, so they would be coming in, so these extra resources. We will be calling in all reserve police officers who are not presently on actual duty to assist us. They would be coming in from Monday. They would be available to us. And once again, I must um, again thank members of the public for their cooperation, those who send um, calls, WhatsApp, and so on, indicating um, possible areas that um, may have persons um, who were supposed to have been in quarantine. I once again thank all.